here. Uh, we are at Telus 360, the 24 East King Street, Lancaster, Pennsylvania, and I am not James Calm, and I am not the guy on the bike. Um, but I wanted to take you to uh, Telus 360's um, landscape painting show that Quinn McNichol just put on. Nice gallery space. You have to go to the second floor. And this show features a couple, two or three, Mount Gretna School of Art um, grads. Uh, there's Nancy Baum. There's a number of other fine painters in the show as well. It's a very thick, robust painting by um, Rick Fox. It's another one of Nancy's drawings. Sorry about the glare. Little painting by um, Megan Wyrick. I think this is an impressive first show for this gallery. Uh, Jane McNichol. So there's a Mount Gretna School of Art student, Sarah D'Ambrosio. There's a painting by one of the jurors, Dorothy Fry. It's a Pennsylvania College of Art and Design student, Maddie Gies. I was very pleasantly surprised to see a Janet Neewald in the show. It's a Mount Gratina School of Art student, Ben Lowry. Casey Dixon. So Ola Alduz. A hardcore painting. Take a quick pan of the rest of the show. Josh Krapura. Apologize if I miss anybody. These might be tricky with the backlight. I'll do my best. It's a pan of paintings. Another Janet Newald. Structure. Eileen Heasley print, Pennsylvania College of Art and Design student. So Mimi Shapiro, collage. It's another Mount Gretna student, Sarah D'Ambrosio. One of Diana Horowitz students from Brooklyn College. Caitlin Williams. It's Ola Abduz again. It's another Ben Lowry. Nice group show. Another, um, Marisa Renee. It's a painting by one of the other jurors, Glenn Sebulash. Also one of the inaugural year. Mount Gretna School of Art lead painting teachers. It's 
is a view to the east outside Mount Gretna. Hmm, he must have done this while he was here. I didn't see it. Another Rick Fox painting. Nice space. This is, uh, in my opinion, one of the more interesting actual gallery spaces in town, too, with this much natural light you know, flooding in from the windows all the way around. Um, <coughs> it's Tom Barrett's. Another very accomplished painting. Flat color patches across the surface and contrast to that deeper space. Fox. Again, I'll pan the show here so you can see the space. And there's one more row of paintings around the corner. So Stacy Caldwell. I apologize if I miss anybody. Brian Lehman. Another one of Mount Gretna's students. Also one of. Um, Bob Andrulli's students at Millersville University. Owen Bradley. Sweet little triptych. Quinn McNichol, the new gallery director here at TELUS 360, is a Pennsylvania College of Art and Design graduate who has also studied extensively at um, Rome Art Program, New York Studio School, Chautauqua School of Art, and Mount Gretna School of Art. She's deploying all the um, networking and relationships on this show is another Megan Wyrick, Pennsylvania College of Art and Design. There's a Rick Fox painting again. These uh, robust paintings caught my attention right away the first night. <laughs> It was a packed opening last night, and I decided to come back today and get some quiet photos of the show. This long panorama by Todd Smith. Ennis Hancock. Joseph Parrish. There's some very reasonably priced art. $200 for that. Fine little painting. <clears throat> Julia Bowden. There's another Nancy Baum. Who I believe is painting very well. Jim Yaskalis. Another little Ben Flowery painting. Mount Gretna School of Art student. Uh, Stacy Caldwell. And lastly, 
a Megan Wyrick. Seems very at home with uh, paint. That's it. I'm very proud of Quinn and Lancaster. And thank you to Tells360 for creating this opportunity for everyone involved. <laughs>